Can you browse the web on Roku? This is a common question for new Roku users. The short answer is that Roku devices don't come with a built-in web browser as of August 2025. Here's what a typical Roku home screen looks like. As you can see, Roku is designed around streaming apps like Netflix, Hulu, and Amazon Prime Video. The interface focuses on channels and apps rather than web browsing functionality. Roku takes a curated approach to content. Instead of giving you access to the entire internet, Roku provides specific apps for different services. This is like having a carefully organized library versus wandering through an endless bookstore. Why did Roku make this choice? There are three main strategic reasons. First, it keeps the user interface simple and user-friendly. Second, it provides better performance by optimizing the device specifically for streaming. Third, it allows Roku to maintain content control and provide a curated experience. There are also technical reasons why Roku doesn't support web browsing well. Roku devices have limited memory, typically between 256 megabytes to one gigabyte of RAM. The ARM processors are optimized for video decoding, not complex web rendering. Plus, the remote control interface isn't ideal for navigating websites that were designed for mouse and keyboard input. Instead of web browsing, Roku uses dedicated apps for each streaming service. Here you can see the Hulu app details in the Roku channel store. Each service gets its own optimized app that works perfectly with the Roku remote and interface. The key takeaway is that Roku is fundamentally a streaming device, not a web browser. It's designed specifically for apps like Netflix, Hulu, and Disney+. This is a strategic choice by Roku to maintain simplicity and optimal performance. However, if you absolutely need web access, there are some workarounds available, though they come with significant limitations. Since Roku doesn't have a native web browser, we need to use workaround solutions. The most reliable method is screen mirroring, which lets you project your device's screen onto your TV through Roku. Screen mirroring works by sending your device's display wirelessly to your Roku. This gives you full web browsing capability since you're actually using your phone, tablet, or computer's browser. For Android devices, casting is built right into the system. Most Android phones and tablets can cast directly to Roku without installing additional apps. iPhone and iPad users can use Apple AirPlay on newer Roku models. You'll need to enable AirPlay in your Roku settings first, then you can mirror your iOS device's screen. Windows 10 and 11 computers support Miracast for wireless display. You can also cast specific browser tabs using Google Chrome's built-in casting feature. If you prefer to browse directly on your Roku, there are third-party browsers available in the Roku Channel Store. However, these come with significant limitations. The two main browser options are Web Browser X and Poprism Web Browser. Web Browser X is more popular, but both have similar limitations due to Roku's hardware constraints. These third-party browsers face serious technical limitations. Roku devices have limited processing power and memory, making them struggle with modern websites that require advanced JavaScript or multimedia content. To put this in perspective, third-party browsers on Roku load pages 15 to 30 seconds slower than your phone, crash about 35% of the time, and only work properly with 45% of modern websites. For the best web browsing experience on your TV, stick with screen mirroring from your smartphone, tablet, or computer. It's faster, more reliable, and gives you access to the full web without limitations. Remember these key points. Screen mirroring gives you the full web experience. Third-party browsers are available but limited. And for complex websites or streaming, your phone or computer will always work better than Roku's built-in options.